Welcome back to the Natty Midnight Show. That should actually be a real thing. I like that. The Natty Midnight Show, or just the Midnight Show, where we talk about like creepy, weird things. <laughs> Before I get into my lately favorites, I'm gonna start off by saying congratulations to the two winners of my last giveaway. Here are the winners. The first one is Off With The Wind, Mikaya Davis. It says here, retired cheerleader and military. The second winner is Virginia Serrato. Should I be showing people's Instagram? So my first favorite is the Makeup Forever Step 1 Skin Equalizer. And this is the Smoothing Primer. Now they have a couple of these. I chose the Smoothing Primer because this is the one that's gonna balance out my skin's texture. I have rust spots. I have tra uh, flake drakiness. I think it's a hotline bling thing song that's been going around. I don't even like Drake. Anyways, I have flakiness. Just overall big pores. I like my skin to be completely even or as even as possible. And this is why I chose this one over another one that I was going to get. I was going to initially get the one that reduces redness since I do have redness. That's the green one, but I decided to get the one that smooths out my skin. I actually do see a huge difference when I apply this versus when I don't, and then I apply my foundation. It really does just create a nice, smooth canvas. Your foundation just kind of glides on. All in all, it just blurs out all the imperfections and all my pores. My second favorite is the Makeup Forever Matte Velvet Plus. I tried the other Makeup Forever foundation that they have a couple of years ago. I never really liked it. It was way too liquidy. The consistency for me has to be a little bit thicker. That's what she said. A Additionally, that one did not provide the coverage that I need. This guy right here has amazing, amazing coverage, consistency, packaging. It's super cute. This is an oil-free, water-resistant product, and it does provide medium to full coverage. Definitely buildable. This evens out my skin nicely, and it doesn't take forever to dry. I don't like foundations. They take forever to dry or kind of feel tacky until you actually set it. This, if I don't set it, I won't have a problem with it. It being sticky or transferring, it does finish to like a nice powdery kind of finish. Not too powdery though, it's not gonna be over drying either. I'm convinced I was British in my past life. I absolutely love tea. All my friends could attest for this. That kind of brings me to my next favorite and it's the Thin Tea Blend. And I have these two right here. In the morning, I like to have the Detox Blend. And you're supposed to have this with your breakfast. Even though it says Thin Tea, it's not gonna make you skinny unless you get your ass to the gym and you stop eating. How However, I have noticed that I haven't been as bloated and I get to use the bathroom and poop a little bit more frequently which is always great and that helps with bloating. I'm not going to go into the benefits of tea, I'm sure you guys already know or can google that. All this contains is tea, natural tea leaves and nothing else. It's gluten free, it's vegan, it's dairy free, it's laxative free, it's everything free and there are no additives. One more time if you're expecting to lose weight just using tea, sorry to break it to ya, that's not going to happen. My next favorite is the Makeup Forever 108 Straight Flat Brush. It has a wooden handle and I absolutely love that. I love wooden handles. This is a multi-use brush. You could use it with foundation. You could use it with anything you pretty much want. I like to use this for my setting powder underneath my eye. So I dip it in the powder and then I just start patting it. Because it's flat, it allows for more control and you could just really pat that and pack that product in there. The bristles are extremely, extremely soft. They just feel like, ugh. So I'm not a lipstick person, but ever since I discovered the Makeup Forever number no. nine lipstick, it kind of looks like this one, right? But it's not. I found the most amazing, cheapest dupe for it, and it's the Make Me. Uh, and this is the Maybelline 660 Touch of Spice Matte Color. It's the one I have on my lips right now. All right, that is all for this video. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down. Don't do that. And I'll see you all in my next button. <laughs> button. <laughs> and I'll see you all in my next video. Oh yeah, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Please, if you're new to my channel, don't forget to hit subscribe. So wherever it is, either up or down, just, just hit the subscribe button.